A very good morning to all my lovely children. I hope you all are fine. Today we are going to learn about tenses. So let's start. What is a tense? Let me tell you. Tense means any form of the verb. Any form of the verb that shows the time of the action or state. Or you can say tense means time. So children, tenses tell us about the time of an action. For example, I study. When do I study? I study every day. So we use the present tense to talk of action that we do every day. So this is present tense. But if I say I study, When did I study? I studied some time ago. Which means I studied in the past. So, this is past tense. So, children, past tense tells us about an action of the past. What if I say I will study I will study in the future. Maybe tomorrow or later. So here this is future tense. So future tense tells us about an action that will take place in future. Now let's see use of not. With the verb to be. Or you can say use of not with the helping verbs or auxiliary verbs. So children, words like is, am, are, was and were are some of the helping Verbs. Or you can say auxiliary verbs. So, words like is, am, are, was, and were are some of the helping verbs, or you can say auxiliary verbs. Now, let's see how to use not with the helping verb. Harry is going to school. He is not. So children, we put not after the helping verb is. Not play on the street. We use not after the helping verb is. So here the word not is used to show the opposite of an action. Harry is going to school. He is not playing on the street. So this is how we use not with the helping verbs. Or you can say auxiliary verbs. Children always remember that. We use not after the helping verbs is, am, are, 
was were it always comes after is a are was were so children i hope you have understood what are tenses and how to use not with the helping verb thank you bye bye